It's morning. Billy's vlog. Good morning, guys. I ended the vlog abruptly last week, but um, I just knew if I continued into the week that it just wouldn't work for me. Anyways, today's Monday. Welcome back. Um, and we have a few things we need to get done today. If you're wondering how my driving lesson went, I'm not sure if I talked about it, but it went really well. Um, and mum took me out for a spin yesterday. Obviously we're her in the car. <laughs> because I'm allowed to do that. Yeah, so we have to go to town. Um, not sure if I'll bring you guys. We'll see what happens. I've tried, I'm trying another way to edit the vlog. Tried this morning to do it on the laptop. And it went back to the free version. Which will be watermarked. Um, the vlog if I edit it and upload it. Um, so I just decided to do it a bit differently this time. Um, anyways, yeah, today's Monday as I said. We do have a bit planned today for Monday. Mum has to get her eyes tested at half ten. I will probably go to Cup on Kyol and turn on the coffee machine and get it ready for tomorrow because um, we're open tomorrow. We're going to see how it goes this week and next week. We will see how it goes and hopefully we'll go back into regular restrictions instead of these level 3 restrictions. Um, and if we go into level 5, it means that we'll have to close and it just goes all downhill from there again. But look, we'll, fit, we'll cross that bridge when it comes to it. So I have spent my morning cleaning the utility room downstairs. I didn't bring my camera down obviously because I thought I was only going to reheat my coffee or fill up my cup and reheat some coffee. But I ended up cleaning out the utility room. Um, Mum got a phone call from Specsavers. They had to cancel her appointment this morning. So we are not in any rush to go to Specsavers. Um, at half ten, it is half past nine now. Um, going back as well, when I was talking about Vlogmas, I'm not sure if I talked about it in this vlog or the vlog before, but it doesn't matter. I talked about it. I think I may do daily vlogs for Vlogmas this year because I won't have enough storage, as I said, to do weekly because I know I will do a lot of vlogging um, at Christmas time. So... Vlogmas this year, I think, is going to be daily, which you might be happy with. If you are, then leave a comment and let me know. I don't know if I mentioned, but I did order Gigi a advent calendar on eBay, which should be coming within the next few days. So that will be ready, set up. I nearly have everything off for Christmas. I just have three more people to get for, which would be my secret Santa person um for my family obviously and i have to get for my oh actually four people to get for three small things for them three people three friends um nothing too extravagant because this year i have pushed the boat out for mum again for christmas <laughs> so yeah um it's going to be a tough one um, money wise but look we'll get there we were approved for the finance of the car so we have to go and look at the car today um, or a car today and uh, yeah I'm going to leave it at that because I don't want to leave this clip running good too good afternoon long. I am back from town and I got basically everything sorted for Christmas presents wise so I got my secret Santa present for Christmas and obviously um, I got my three friends their presents as well one of them was wrapped the other two aren't wrapped because it came from a different shop and I got the other one wrapped because she asked me did I want it wrapped and I said yes so the secret Santa one is wrapped as well I don't really want to show you too much um, but what I can show you is this my rituals order came um, this is the advent calendar and it is huge. I don't know if I mentioned that, that I was getting one um, from Rituals, but yeah, that came. My new iPad case came. We have her. 
I got a white one. It's the same as my pink, only that it's white. And it came with a, a pen as well. I got one of those that came today. What else? Something else came today. And I can't have shown the vlog in case mum watches it. So, yeah. And I got loads of little bits in pennies for Christmas for a little basket that I'm going to make up myself. Um, not sure of where I'm going to get the basket, but I think I might just improvise and see if I can get, or even like a Christmas bag and put the stuff into a Christmas bag because there's not an awful lot, but there is like a few bits. Um, but another thing I picked up for myself, which you're probably going to go, Billy, why did you buy another one? Is a snuddy, I think they're called. But this one is called a reversible Sherpa hoodie. I don't know what it means by reversible. Does that mean you can wear it the other way around? I don't care. I don't want to really wear it the other way around. If you know me, I have this in grey. So I got my cell phone in pink. I'll show you now. Out of this the is it. Out of the package. It's huge. And that's what I love about it. Um, oh, and it has little stretchy things. My other one doesn't. But it has that fluffiness inside. I'm going to put it on me now in a minute and show you. But this is... My grey one that I have that I got in Shaw's. Uh, I don't know how long ago, but see how this one doesn't have the sleeves with the cuffs on. It just has regular sleeves, which I don't mind if it has cuffs on. Um, but this one was like 20 euro reduced in Shaw's. I don't know how much it was regularly. I'm just going to throw that down on the bed. But this one is pink and it's different. The other one is grey and like obviously grey is grey but I'm going to put this on me now just to see how it feels oh it's just as cosy I don't know if it's as bulky or as heavy but it still feels cosy ass so yeah glad I picked one of those up for myself now I do notice that the hood is different on my grey one it's a lot heavier and the lining around here is a lot heavier on the grey one but like come on it's literally for wearing around the house oh and the inside doesn't have the fluffy this whereas on this one it does as you can see now it doesn't this side but it does on this side but this one doesn't have it at all but I don't care because it's still cozy and this one isn't as warm which might be a good thing because sometimes when I wear this one it gets very hot and warm I'm gonna open the advent calendar obviously I'm not gonna open the days I'm gonna open the advent calendar and I'll show you yes, this is it wrapped in its um, box but as you can see this is what it's supposed to look like inside it smells amazing I'm going to try and do this without having to put it down because you won't be able to see. Um, the bed is kind of too far away to do it that way. But I'm trying to do my best here. And it's not working. Great. It's here either. Now, I don't know how I'm going to get this off. Oh, like so. So we have that. And then... Oh, this pushes open like so oh my god it is so cute look it's like a little house oh my god oh my god smell it smells divine but i'm gonna leave it in that now um for christmas and i'm going to put it somewhere safe so i don't break it or anything um or spill all the stuff out that's in it i didn't know that that was going to come today but it did thankfully um oopsie it's already fun um but it came today um when the delivery driver had said that he had package for me he said he was going to leave it into the shop next door because it was going to be delivered to cup on Kyol, obviously but he said he'd leave it in the shop next door. He didn't have it on him at the time. So anyways, he delivered it into the shop next door and I collected it. I didn't know that it was going to be my rituals order. I thought it was going to be stuff off eBay. As I said, I thought it was going to be Gigi's advent calendar, but it was actually my advent calendar. Um, and then when I remembered, I had remembered that I had actually 
ordered the advent calendar for Gigi to the house. <laughs> I think. I don't know because he had something else for me and he gave that to mum while she was standing in, waiting for me to get the other. Anything, doesn't matter. Anyway, it doesn't matter. Um, I have everything really sorted. I just need to put them in bits, bit the bits in areas because it's all over my room. Everything is wrapped and put away. Um, I have everything up here. I don't want to open it too quickly and get it falls out. All my friends and secret Santa present is in there. And I have two of mum's presents down here. Sorry about the bra. <laughs> down that corner anyways beside my wainscot um they're wrapped also and then i have the christmas tree here on the bed because i wanted to plug it in to see if it's working uh i thought there was going to be like three plugs with it and then i, I realized that you plug it in at the top it stretches down to the bottom and there's little parts that you can plug into i don't know how it's going to work but i'm going to try and just Plugging it in first of all, be a good thing. Okay, the top part works. Finally got it. It works then. Oh my God, it's such a complicated tree because one section is like, it's going to be the bottom, but there was like a plastic cap at the end. So obviously when I pulled the plastic cap off the end, it, was, it wasn't actually that part that went into this tree. It doesn't matter. Um, I figured it out, but I think you can actually have the tree just have two pieces so it's not six foot That it's probably only about four foot So it's handy I suppose in, in a way um, If you want it it's shorter or smaller Then is what am I standing on? I don't know, but anyways, I'm going to take it apart again Obviously, and I'm going to put it back into the box. I know my face is a wreck It needs to be washed the makeup has had some type of reaction to my face um obviously the mascara is all over the place but it's just all here anyways apart from that i'm so proud of myself i have put away my money for my driving lessons like all 12 lessons i have it all put away and i still have like 60 something euro for myself i have christmas presents bought i have basically everything got and I still have my own money meaning 60 or for myself that I'm keeping in a savings box anyways that I will be putting into the credit union maybe tomorrow um or Thursday either Tuesday or Thursday one or the other anyways apart from that I just want to let you know I just took my pennies receipt out from today and I basically spent 86 euro today and one thing out of that was for me and that one thing for me cost 15 euro and the rest was on Christmas presents same today I spent 85 euro in Ward's Chemist and this was the only thing for me <laughs> Um, but at least I got two things for myself. I got a pair of, I don't know, can you see them? Them leggings over there. I'm trying to point. Them. Them black leggings. I got a size 12. Hopefully they fit me. They're very stretchy. So I'm going to hope for the best. If not, because I'm losing weight, they will fit me. Eventually. I don't like buying clothes that are too small for me. Um, but sometimes I don't mind if it's as cheap as 15 euros for a pair of trousers that I know I will fit into in maybe two or three weeks or if not now. Anyway, yeah, so I have all that put away. I have the money for my Christmas present for mum um, in my bank ready to be paid for for when it arrives. If the trousers up on me, but they don't feel comfortable just yet. Let me see, can you see them? This is them. <laughs> My belly. I know it's very, very, very blurry. But they are fitting me, but not comfortably. So I'll give it another three or four weeks and they will fit me comfortably. They're not going up over my... They are up over my bum, but I'd prefer if they were a little bit higher. The button closes and so does the zipper. 
but I'm glad I got the size 12 now because as I was pulling them up I was like oh I should have got size 14 but they actually fit me but not comfortably comfortably so yeah they will fit me properly in the next two or three I give a four weeks tops but at least I know that they fit me and when they fit me more kind of comfortably I will feel more comfortable <laughs> good evening good evening guys it is Tuesday evening I don't know if I don't think I picked up the camera this morning but it is now evening time not much happened today if I'm being quite honest literally woke up this morning went down did my usual routine make the coffee bring Gigi or let Gigi out feed Gigi um come upstairs chill out for a while put the scones on vice versa same thing every other day um only thing that did happen today oh the kids presents came for christmas um to cup on coal and i wrapped them Gigi's advent calendar came it is downstairs um but if i get a chance to show you in this vlog it won't really matter because you're going to get get to see it soon anyways for december but yeah um mum's perfume came that's wrapped in my handbag i need to take it out as well and that's it i think that's all that really happened today um i'm trying to think what um i have planned for this week only that i have my driving lesson on friday and um that's it my nails on monday next week that's it it is 10 past 10 i need to floss my teeth and then brush my teeth before bed so i shall talk to you guys tomorrow Gigi's advent calendar is actually upstairs i just spotted it as i was brushing my teeth or as i went into the hallway to go back into what you walking hall in that present on that ground but this is the advent calendar I'm going to have to turn this way so you can see. Well, actually, I'm going to have to turn this way. It's the Lily's Kitchen, um, the Christmas Spectacular Advent Calendar, and it's wrapped in plastic, as you can see. I'm going to actually leave that in my room beside my Advent Calendar for this year. Um, and I remember I said that I was have to get a chocolate one, but I was actually thinking... Is there any point in me getting a chocolate one? Because at the end of the day, I fast <laughs> every morning, and the chocolate wouldn't be it. So maybe I might just get a chocolate one, and then it'll be it in the evening time. Then that'll be my treat in the evening. Anyways, I'm going again. Bye. I look like a bean. <laughs> Good evening, guys. Um, <laughs> I was going to be really serious about this uh, talking to you. It's going on my hair. Anyways, it is evening, Wednesday. I look like a ball of walnuts or a, what is a ball of walnuts? I look like a bean. I look like um, something out of Monsters Inc. But anyways, I cut my hair as you can see, but it looks so strange here and here. It looked fine a while ago, but I don't know why it looks so weird on the vlog. And that's why I keep looking in the viewfinder. So if you wonder why my eyes are gravitating towards up here, it's, it's because... Uh, anyways, good evening, guys. As I said, it is Wednesday evening. I've done tan. If you're wondering why I look like a walnut, it's because I've done some tan. I had a nice long shower for myself after I cut my hair. I actually, what I did was, I flossed my teeth, brushed my teeth, and then I was like, I washed my face. So I cl um, cleansed my face. And then I said, do you know what? I'm gonna tone my face. So then I toned my face and then I said, do you know what? I'm gonna cut my hair. So I did, I might have to go over it again in the morning or I mightn't have to, I might just rinse it and put some finishing cream or mousse or something in. Anyways, after that obviously I had to have a shower because hair was all over my neck everywhere. I just felt, it just feels really itchy. So I had a shower and um, I shaved my legs. So, oh God, I keep getting notifications from 
Koi footwear and boohoo and pretty little thing because um, I was on them today. But anyways, yeah, so I said, oh, you know, I'm going to shave my legs. So I shaved my legs and then as I was shaving my legs in the shower, I decided that I was going to do some fake tan when I come out, even though it's winter. And how would I get a regular tan? Don't care. But I just did it anyways. So that's why I look like a walnut because I did some fake tan. Good morning, good morning guys. Finally a good morning. My hair is still acting really weird. But anyways, it is half past seven in the morning and I have the scones done. I have Gigi fed, I have the coffee made and I'm drinking the coffee at the moment. I have spuds on for the dinner for this evening because there was, we kind of ate all the spuds yesterday. Not all of them, but just kind of extra spuds or potatoes um and i'm going to have a shower to watch off this tan so i show my face because like it looks holy sure but it's just a rinse and then i might moisturize afterwards anyways i have a bit of good news the order from little woods i don't know if i was talking about it yesterday but it has moved thank god and it's going to be delivered today it was supposed to be delivered yesterday but there was a bit of a delay in it i had to ring them and say to them about, you know, the order hasn't moved. I started getting nervous. But anyways, I think I did talk about it yesterday. So it is being delivered today. And that is everything, apart from two presents for the kids, delivered um, for Christmas. So literally just have to get, mum has to get her secret santa present and then that's us clear for christmas and it's not even november yet like how good is that the only thing is i hate things sitting in boxes for too long <laughs> not having a designated owner until christmas day anyways it doesn't matter they're all sorted so i may see if i can get the present for mum's secret santa the weekend um and then we're we're clear we're done for the for christmas it's fun it's great can't wait um nothing exciting planned today only that i may go into work a little bit later this morning um unless it starts raining and that means i have to go with mum in the car because i don't want to get the scooter wet car lesson or driving lesson tomorrow um that's it that's it for my week, like, you know. Um, yeah, bye. Good evening. It is Saturday. And don't know why I didn't vlog the past couple of days. But anyways, I'm going to end the vlog with a bang. And show you the haul that I got from Penny's today. Or Primark. Um, all new clothes that I needed in order to fit into my clothes now. Because I've lost that much weight that my other clothes are too big. Or else the clothes that I used to have when I did a big clear out are gone. So I'm going to do like a try on haul kind of thing. Um, but first I need to get changed. But actually I'm going to do this first. I got this hoodie. This grey hoodie is basically plain grey hoodie. Now let's get on to the rest. I'm leaving tags on until I um, actually wear them. But this is... Outfit number one, this is a nice blue kind of polo neck top that I got and I got a pair of jeans. Oh my god, <laughs> such a struggle. I don't know what is going on in Penny's jeans. I got my usual size. My usual size being when I was a little bit heavier than what I am now. Um, but still like the same size. But anyways, they fit but I wish they came up a bit more. But yeah. I got a size 14 in the jeans and a size 10 to 12 in the top. I'm actually roasting, so I'm going to leave the jeans on and do tops. I got a lot of long sleeve tops that I'm not even going to bother trying on. They're plain, but I'm going to try on the colored y kind of ones. Top numero dos. It's literally a long sleeve. Um, I know you can see my bra. Sorry about that. It's long sleeve, black and white, as you can see long sleeve t-shirt and I got two white ones and a plain grey one that I'm not going to show up but I'll show you the kind of brighter coloured ones as I just found. Number three is a basic um, 
fluffy polo neck jumper and got a size small as well if you're wondering all the sizes in the tops are all smalls um yeah so this is for pennies is closing well today i got on my bets there's another one i don't know what happened there but anyways here's another one of these polo necks it is a kind of wine color as you can see i also got the same color in a long sleeve well they're they're very similar in a long sleeve um top that i'm not going to try on because there's no point um yeah and i got another long sleeve as well in this mustardy color um if you can just picture it on then would do me fine um rather than go on through it again um i got two of these white ones i also got a gray striped one and it's kind of cream it doesn't look cream on camera it looks more white but it actually is cream and i got a black one of these um actually no that's a lie it's a black full polo neck and this would be more so for work um and if i want to wear it otherwise but i got some pants i'm gonna try on those pants now i'm actually in love with these pants now i cannot show you too much because <laughs> i'm wearing pink underwear and you can really see it so i'm gonna bring it back far enough into the shade but yeah they're really nice now i know you can see this but this is a lot smaller than what it was but they're long kind of baggy i love um i'm gonna show mum and then i'll oh i thought they had pockets i'll get this now there we go so i put this white jumper on and got the leathers or the leather leggings fake kind of leather leggings i got a size small today because the medium um they're fine on the leg but the band on them was just a bit too loose for the top so these fish a lot nicer around the area <laughs> even though my belly is still a bit hangy but if i wear a top like this you can't even notice okay on to the next pants and <laughs> are these black leggings with two white stripes going down they also have a um a drawstring there got these in a size medium which is a 12 to 14 reason being i got them in that size was because they had the drawstring and i know they fit a lot more comfortable on my legs in the medium size rather than the small um but yeah i got them in the medium because I just wanted a piece for my legs for a minute. So they're actually really, really comfortable. Not really telling you the prices because I couldn't be actually bothered. Last but <laughs> certainly, uh, certainly not least, I'm just fixing the ankles, is my grey tracksuit bottoms. Woo hoo hoo hoo. Literally plain grey tracksuit bottoms. That's it. That's everything that I got except for a pair of pyjamas that I'm not going to get into at the moment anyways because I need to have a shower and go into them then. Um, yeah, I by mistake bought hoodie and bottoms the same uh, set but they weren't together on the shelves so I wanted a plain grey jumper because the one I have now is too big and it's worn out a bit. So I wanted a new one so I got this and um, I wanted a pair of tracky bottoms for just lounging around the house or if I need to get from A to B quickly and then just throw a pair of tracky bottoms on. It's just a lot easier. Anyways guys, I hope you enjoyed this weekly vlog. I know there wasn't much. I hope this makes up for it. If you did like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you like me, or you could like me <laughs> in the future, then subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Don't forget that I love you. Mwah. Don't forget to keep positive, and I shall see you soon with another video. Hopefully. Goodbye. Mm -hmm.